Hello friends, welcome to the channel Physics by IIT. In this video, we will talk about Joint Entrance Screening Test or JEST exam 2024. So, JEST 2024 is being organized by IAFT Thiruvarantapuram and the tentative exam date is on 3rd March 2024. So, only 20 days or about uh, near about 20 days is on the left. So, now question is how to prepare JEST physics exam within this short duration of time. So just let me tell you, this time the JEST physics will be fully computer based test and the duration is only 3 hours and JEST PCS will consist of two parts, one is the computer based and another is the descriptive part to answer using pen and paper. So now, how to handle this uh, exam, uh, how to prepare for this exam so that you can easily handle the questions. So first of all, since you have to give all the questions answers uh, with a proper, uh, like because uh, with a accuracy because there is negative marks. So why you, what you can have to understand that you, you have a very less chance to uh, make negatives because once you have scored higher and then if you also have negative marks then you will your score will be less so avoid all the negative marking this is first of all and now why you have uh, jest exam is important because using jest uh, scorecard you can apply for phd and integrated phd in different research institutes in india Research institutes like Aizar all over the India, Aizar Kolkata, Aizar Pune, Aizar Bhopal, Aizar Mohali, Raman Research Institute, RRI, IIS Bangalore, uh, uh, TIFR, and uh, many other research institutes. They will take students from the JEST scorecard. Right? So, since you understand, this is very important exam to secure a place in PhD in research institutes in IIT Delhi. Therefore, the exam will not be easy. And the question paper will be mostly designed by the professors or researchers or scientists, I should say, scientists from this participating institution. So since they are scientists, they are expert in the field. So they will not make very simple questions. They can design simple as well as tricky and some complex questions. So the level of the exam you can think about not so much difficult but could be intermediate. So where well, you need to figure out some formulas as well as some concepts to solve the paper. So today is 10th February 2024 and the exam is on 3rd March. So in this time less than 20 days or even like or the preparation is about that what you can do first check the previous paper of jet for an example i have given a list of the topics and the questions and marks are coming from the topics in a jest exam so in jest 20 2018 and 2019 the mathematical physics part uh, the questions from mathematical physics had a weightage of 9 and 12 in 2019 classical mechanics 13 and 9 18 and 19 optics it was only very less number only one marks question in 2018 and four marks question in 2019 electromagnetic theory in 2018 seven marks in 2019 six marks statistical mechanics thermal physics eight and six respectively quantum mechanics seven marks for both the year electronics only three marks Atomic and molecular physics 1 and 2 marks in 18 and 19 respectively. Nuclear physics only 1 marks and solid state physics there was no question. So if you see the statistics I uh, and I also would like to suggest you that make this kind of statistics for all topics for the latest 20, 20, uh, 2021, 2022 and 2023 papers also and prioritize the topics which have the most weightage and which has the less weightage okay this could be your first tip so that you can understand okay uh, this much part of the paper will come from this particular topic 
and once you have uh, the knowledge of how what is the distribution of the topics and their marks in the exam paper or question paper you can prioritize your subjects which you prefer let's say you prefer mathematical physics and you less prefer atomic molecular physics so what you can do you start from mathematical physics and then add the solve the questions from the previous paper and also from the exercises from the books like for mathematical physics i can suggest hk dart or arfkin so you can solve the exercises and then come back to solve the questions for this paper so why only it is important to solve the exercise because solving exercise will will help to make the concept and solution uh, or practicing the question paper test paper from just or question prepare, previous year question paper will give you the confidence for the exam so this is very important concepts building as well as numerical solving once you have prioritized the subject and prepare solving numericals plus concepts is very important and prepare at least 3 to 4 basic concepts basic means that classical mechanics mathematical physics quantum mechanics statistical mechanics these are the basic topics and atomic nuclear nuclear physics solid state physics these are the advanced topics so prepare at least four basic topics completely so within very short time how you can do that you can just i tell you first go through the all previous year papers check their weightage and see how much is the uh, carry how what kind uh, which topic carries the most weightage if you are comfortable in that subject then start preparing the subject first from the exercise of uh, any textbook and also from this and also you can uh, see other net physics papers and uh, get physics trivia solution so just don't restrict yourself to solve the previous year solution which usually students do they restrict their themselves just to solve the previous year questions and they don't make their concepts clearly so once they get similar kind of question it will be helpful but if you get some complex questions or different kind of question then you, you might be lost lost in the exam so to avoid that situation you need to have some concepts and some uh, for that purpose you need to refer the textbook and you need to solve the exercise okay so this could be very very important thing for you so prepare at least 3 to 4 topics check previous year's papers solve numericals plus build concepts from the textbook and within the 20 days so should i tell you only 5 to 6 hours will be enough for you no i am not sure you have to give at least 10 hours in the in a day to make to give proper effort to for this exam okay this is very important and uh, one more announcement from our ch uh, channel is that we are offering physics just physics test free test uh, and uh, the test is going to be online we will offer free of cost free of cost this is only for just 2024 physics so the test series we will upload on 15 23 february and 1st of march so please register for this test series freely available for all the students so the more detailed information i will share in the youtube as well as telegram as well as our facebook group so please Subscribe the channel and get all updates for this for this 2024 and share with your friends. Thank you.